Hello everyone, we're back to uh, Wild Willy. Did another hop up for him today in the mail. Aluminium servo stays, servo mounts. Uh, the biggest problem with this car's design is the way the servo is mounted in the chassis there. And with the big wheels, when you turn, see the servo flexing and slopping around when you hit bumps and stuff. Also, moves that servo around. So, we're going to get uh, these wheels back off, and I'll show you uh, my way of taking the servo out of this vehicle. Okay, I've got the wheels off again and as you can see it mounts in between the two chassis halves and yeah as you build the car you screw it to this side of the chassis before you put the chassis together but you mount all your electronics right on the seam there so instead of ripping all that off what I do is from under here you can detach the servo horn and with the wheels off you can get to both of those screws that hold the servo in place. There we go, let's get the new bits in. There we go, we got the servo out, and you can see plastic mounts, very flexible, and uh, the holes strip out easy when you tighten them down too, so that's going to be another big improvement with the, the metal parts, let's get them put on and see how it looks. Okay, we've got the pieces attached to the servo now. Little old Loctite in there. Already looks a lot stronger. Looks nicer too. Metal clamping metal. The sucker put back together. It's all back in now. It's not entirely central, but it doesn't really matter, I don't think. Let's test it out. No flex. Oh, very tiny it compared to how it was. Thanks for watching.